Hey, I'm Portland McDavid, but this is Sports Time News. I'm Dvorak, and this is going to be the latest Philadelphia Phillies video. As in the midst of the lockout, there's a cool video. As we have news on some new broadcasts that are going to be coming in, as Kevin Franson uh, became the Nationals TV color commentator. That opened the spot on the radio, and the Phillies decided to foot, fill it with one guy that we're familiar with from the 16-18 to 18 season, former player Kevin Stocker, Chad Durbin. Michael Bourne, and Eric Kratz. So, four for one, uh, the Phillies get in the broadcast booth, where it looks like Larry Anderson is still going to call, according to um, this article by Cordy Seidman, most home games. But you're going to have a rotation of Michael Bourne, who was a very fun player to watch, speed stroke at steel bases, best years were obviously away from the Phillies, Eric Kratz, was a great player to have on the team. Not Obviously, was one of those career minor league catchers that was great at managing the staff, but when he was up here, you could just tell when they did the interviews with him and everything. He was one of those guys that just loved every second of life because he was just at the MLB level, and those are fun guys to have on the team, and those are fun guys to also probably have as color commentators because he was hilarious as heck some of the time. And Bourne, um, he was a fun player to watch. I'm not sure how he will be um, in, in color commentating, but from watching interviews afar, he did seem to have be pretty good in the interview room, and then Durbin, Durbin was, I mean, he was pretty quiet, he was a pitcher, he didn't, so we'll have to see uh, what he's able to bring, I think he'll be a, probably be able to hopefully analyze similar to maybe how Jamie was able to do from a pitching perspective and give a, give a analyzation from that point, and also how LA does sometimes when it comes to a pitcher having a weird motion or something along those lines. But I think all three could work well because one is a star was is a former All Star speedster outfielder in Michael Bourne. Another is a very good catcher that knows about all the trials and tribulations of making it to the major league in Eric Kratz. So you have a bunch of different perspectives here from these players. And another is Chad Durbin, who's a relief pitcher who knows about the ups and downs and really the ways that the roller coasters uh, work in the relief pitching world, where one year a guy's up here and then the next year he's down here, where only the elite of the elite kind of stay consistent when it comes to relief pitching. So I think it brings a bunch of different perspectives. And then you have Kevin Stocker, who was eh when he was here before, uh, but they have him back in the realm. He has some chemistry with Scott Fransky already, uh, and whatever type of chemistry you want to call it, good or bad. And then um, they got Bourne, Durbin, and Kratz to add on to it. I think it's going to be a good <clears throat> um, grouping to bring in a bunch of different perspectives. This was just a fun, quick video updating on the speedster Michael Bourne back in the Philadelphia Phillies family uh, now as a broadcaster, as a color commentator, Eric Kratz, the funny backup catcher that always seemed to love life when he was up here, back with the Phillies as a broadcaster, as well as Stockers back, and Chad Durbin, the pitcher, uh, who I have a couple autographs of, was a very fun pitcher when we got to meet him. Uh, he's also going to be a color commentator. It's going to be fun to see how this year... Um, those guys mesh in with Scott Franchi in the radio. It's definitely, if the season can finally come back at some point, going to give me a reason even more so to listen to the radio, which is already a great group. I love T-Mac as well, but obviously Franchi LA, that's been a legendary group, duo for a while, and now we're going to see who can form the next duo, uh, who can be the guy that kind of steps up in this grouping of the Borns, the Durbins, the Cracks, and the Stockers of the world. But everybody have a great time and pleasant day. It's just fun that the Phillies brought in this nice group of former Phillies to be able to call the game and give all their different perspectives in the sport. As they're on the radio, as we have a little bit of a rotating team, I think that's fun, though, because it gives us a lot of different perspectives. Have a great day and pleasant day, everybody. Enjoy the rest of the offseason that hopefully ends soon because the lockout should be over and we should be not in an offseason. We should be in spring training right now. But stay safe, everybody. Peace out and go Phillies.